Ali! Didn't hear you come in. Greetings and welcome to Ask That Guy With The Glasses. First of all, thank you for purchasing this DVD. I'm sure many of you were wondering whether or not this was a good use of your money. Perhaps this will answer the question. First question. Can I have a drink from that bar of yours? That's a very good question. And yes, yes you can. You can have a great big bottle of Shut the Fuck Up. Have you never tried Shut the Fuck Up before? Let me go get some. Let's see, Shut the Fuck Up, Shut the Fuck Up. Nope, I seem to be all out of Shut the Fuck Up. But luckily, you can make a nice big bottle of Shut the Fuck Up at home. It's very simple. First you pour in one-fourth of I Don't Give a Shit, one-fourth of Are You Really Still Talking, one-fourth of Please Sleep With Something Before You Die, and one-fourth of I Can't Believe I Paid Money For a DVD That's Just Going To Insult Me. Put that together, and you get a great big bottle of Shut the Fuck Up! With onions. Shut the fuck up. Why aren't you, the nostalgia critic, Chester A. Bum, Black Dog Bill, General Zod, Dr. Smith, and Dominic never on the screen at the same time? Cause we're all the same actors, you fucking idiot! Again, good purchase. My mother was born with a penis, and my dad was born with a vagina. Me and my brother ended up being identical twin homosexuals. But for some reason, we are hermaphrodites. Is there a way our family can live a normal, healthy life without being discriminated against? I don't think so. Your best bet is to go to some foreign country, join the circus, and market yourself as a one-man freak show. Now I know what you're thinking. What about my brother? Leave him to me. To me. Oh, and eat a Twinkie every once in a while. Cause... everybody should. If you light a loaf of bread on fire and it slowly burns to a crisp, is it burnt bread or burnt toast? It is your father! That's not true, that's impossible! Search your feelings, you know for it to be true! No! Bet you didn't see that one coming. I did. Because I'm the one who said it. And now, I eat a 12-month-old cherry. What is the value of X? Oh, 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 X is very valuable indeed. For you see, everybody wants to know the value of X. That's why they created X Mines up in Kentucky. <laughs> Little did they know that they can find plenty of X's in an adult video store. There you will find the most valuable of treasures you've ever seen in your life. They have midget porn, horse porn, Pokemon porn, that's new, and my personal favorite, Jesus porn. It's sort of like the movie The Passion, except it's... No, it's the movie The Passion. So go, children, to your local adult video store today. Yeah. You magnificent bastard, have you read my book? No, I haven't read your book. Because it is not in the file! It's not! Obscure references are awesome! <laughs> Can emos order Happy Meals? No, they don't. They order sad meals. You see, the drawings on the box are black and gray. The side tells you all sorts of ironic dark jokes. And they come with tips with how you can be your most pretentious. And the toy in the sad meal? A scalpel. So you can cut yourself and make blasé artwork. If you don't think you're sad enough to get a sad meal, buy one anyway. You soon will be. So get your sad meals today, because God damn it, I want you to die. God, why aren't you stopping this? Sir, shall I launch the photon torpedoes? No, I'll raise our shields. We have to be ready for anything. Sir, they're firing. Red alert! Damage report! I hurt my toe. Damage report on the ship, you fool! Oh, they hit us from deck one up. Lock onto their signal and fire! I can't. Why can't you? Whoa. Because we're a bar! Blast! God! What? Um, cut it out. Oh, okie dokie. Next question. How do you eat a Reese's peanut butter cup? With onions. 
Nah, you all saw that coming. Um, without onions. Whew. Covered that up pretty well. Did I tell you the story about my friend Chris, who got on a treadmill with a skateboard? No, tell me all about it. Um, I didn't ask the question. You had three seconds. Well, I I don't really know what to say. Tell my wife she gets nothing. <laughs> Life without the narrator. Oh my god, I got a puppy! This is that guy with the glasses saying, There's no such thing as a stupid question until you ask it. Aww, he's so cute. <laughs>